what's up everyone and we're back with another video for you guys today's video will be on another car street diecast this one is on rv from the car street diecast on 2017 i got this off of ebay for 14 dollars free shipping and this is one of the demolition derby containers in car story he's probably one of the biggest as well for him being an rv like i say 95 percent of the demolition derby cars are small tiny cars that are there to have fun but rv dr damage miss fritter are huge compared to the other demolition derby cars and i also include Cruise, cruise and lightning but nonetheless let's go right on with the review of rv so as you guys can see you have his name right now right there on the name tab we got the car street logo right here we got a deluxe logo in the black space right here now this package is extremely damaged as you guys can see i'm not sure if it shows on the camera there's a little dent right there if you look on the bottom this thing opens up pretty well so it doesn't really matter to me because i will be opening him up but let's get on to the back of the package on the back, they show you only two cars, and they show you the two new cars that were in a deluxe case. I'm not sure what the letter of the deluxe case is, but the two new cars were RV, which I'm reviewing in this video, and Mr. Drippy. I do not have Mr. Drippy yet, but hopefully I will be getting him soon. And I also will be getting Morgan Martins very soon, who's in a twin case of this one from someone that a lot of you may know. And here's a bio basically saying what the car scene movie is about. And you want to pause and read that if you like, you may go ahead. Alrighty, so I saw everything I needed to say, so we're going to take RV here out of the package. Alright guys, so I got RV here out of the package, and he looks very awesome out of the box. And he is the smallest RV that Mattel has ever released. But let's get right on with the review of him. So as you guys see, he has this crazy looking expression on him. He looks like he's very happy to be in the Demolition Derby. I mean, he even has a few teeth missing, which means he looks like he loves to go crazy. He even has like this black... Spray, spray, what am I even talking about? Spray paint around his eyes. He has brown eyes, and I'm not sure if this is the correlate with his number right here, the double zero, or he just wanted to put that near his eyes. I'm not entirely sure because they have n had no confirmation about that. I do like his rims. They are very nice. They got the like white design thing to it. Very, very cool. He has double zero on the side of him right here. And what's ironic is that he was available to any retailers and like eBay and stuff like that around the same time as Jimmy Cables. And both of them do show the number zero zero. So that, not sure if that's a coincidence or not. Probably a coincidence. On the back, he also has the double zero. And now he does have a license plate here, which is super small to read because it's very hidden under that big, um, I don't know what to call it, but this little, um, whole thing. I'm not sure what his license plate reads, but it looks like it says R-D-R-A-G-E. At least that's what it looks like. And here we have the little, I guess you can call it like a spare tire kind of thing. It has a bunch of stickers on it. Right here, you can see a Monsters University Easter egg. And that one with the wilderness thing with the W on the tree it might be a reference to up in the wilderness explorer he has a cargo one as well which used to be like a place like Hawaii and the cars world and other ones as well very very cool love that detail on our friend RV here he is a white RV he has a lot of green on the sides of him now, what I forgot to mention on the front, that he has a like, little gray thing going, like an outline around his mouth, and I think they're supposed to represent teeth as well. He also has like these little nose rings right here, which I guess it's called grill rings in the car's world. He has nice rear view mirrors. They, these two are colorful. One is yellow, and one is green, although I'm not sure if that's accurate to the movie or not. I'll have to watch some scenes on YouTube or not. And here we have like his little air vent thing, I'm assuming, on the top of his roof. And also, his base is gray with some Mattel information on it. Now, let's do a comparison to probably the RV that I have, I think, is the most similar to him. I chose Doug RM. I only have two other RVs other than these two. But I thought that Doug RM was the most similar to RV. So, this is a huge, huge RV. And RV here is the smallest RV we have ever gotten. I know it's confusing because his name's RV and he's an RV himself. So, I know it can get a little confusing. I can understand that. But as you guys can see, he is super small for an RV compared to Doug RM here. Tell me in the comment section down below if you prefer RV or Doug RM. I think I prefer Doug RM just because he's related to the Piston Cup while he's related to the Demolition Derby and I prefer the Piston Cup a lot 
more, but I still think RV is a nice and fun character. Probably one of the funniest characters in Cars 3, because he was so crazy in the Demolition Derby. He even had one car go on top of it, and then he had the line saying, look at my new hat. He was just all crazy in Cars 3. And probably one of the most funniest and craziest Demolition Derby cars. Now, before we end off this video, we're obviously going to do the 360. So that's going to do it for this video here, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. Now, to end this off, I want to do a recreation of a shot in car story because Miss Fair walked up to McQueen and Cruz when they were in their disguise, obviously. And these three came in. These were, like, I guess, the big guys in the Demolition Derby. And this is all the places they appeared. RV was on the left. The middle was Miss Fair. And on the right was Dr. Damage. So another question in this video is, which one do you prefer between these three? Definitely my... Um, ranking, ranking on these is Miss Fair, Dr. Damage, and RV. I'm sorry, RV, you're my least favorite out of these three, but you're still a very awesome character. I still like your diecast and your appearance and role in the movie. So, like I was saying, uh, that's it for this video here, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy this video. Thank you guys all for your crazy support recently. I'm going to see you guys all next time in the next video. Peace out.